here are the details of the installation process of the W cells. The first step would be to copy all the files into an arbitrary directory. In our case, the folder name is W cells test 2012. You can choose any name you want. Second step would be to copy three files into C temp directory. Those files are shown here. One of them is the license file. In both folders you must have all the rights, including the right to read, write and delete. Third step would be to double click on wcells.mvx and that would call mapping. Our program is now without any project. We need to create one. We'll type here the name of the new project, for example, test, and we'll click on OK. The program will show us the message and question if we agree with the conditions of program usage, we click on I agree and then basically we are ready to go. A map window would be open and it will have the name according to chosen project name. Also, comparing to map info traditional menu structures, there is an additional uh, menu here, UMTS cells. If you click on it, it will show complicated structure of sub menus uh, that includes all features of W cells program. Also, we see two button pads here, general and UMTS button. If we need to work with other technologies, we can click on buttons GSM module and the new sub menu would appear here. LT module would appear here. With the new button pads created or CDMA. with menu and button bed here. If we don't need those technologies, we can unload those modules. Also here are the modules of map tools, favorite cells, which is convenient to put here. And later we'll see how to use those two modules for statistics and parameters. Basically, we are now ready to go.